Okay, welcome to how to paint the wine glasses. This is a Patrick Caulfield painting. As I will have already mentioned to you, the files that you need to help copy or recreate whatever it is that you want to do are in images and they are here. Mr. Malcolm's links, so ICT share, Mr. Malcolm's links, year five, paint.net short topic three, images. If you can't see them like this, you can move the view finder here and find your image. Once you've found your image, we're going to do the wine glasses. I'm going to go and open this. There we have it. Now, as I spoke about, we're going to make one wine glass and copy and paste and make it into different and put them into different layers. I'm going to do the first wine glass and I'm going to remind you about your backgrounds and naming your layers. So here we are in paint.net. I've got my tool sections here, here are my, my colour tools, my various tools, I've got my, my select, my sample select and other tools. Over here are my layers, so I'm going to bring my layers in so we can see them. First of all, make a new layer. My background, I'm not going to touch my background, I'm going to make a new layer. As I said, I want my layers labelled. This is going to be wine glass one. Okay. Remember what I said as well about it being blue? If it's blue, that is the layer you're working in. If it is white, you are not working in that layer. So, first of all, I'm going to go and open up my wine glass, I'm going to check. The background is yellow. It's like an off yellow. What we'd probably call a mild ochre. So I'm going to go and use my colour palette, which is down here. And you can see that I've selected a similar colour. Next I'm going to use my fill tool. Double check I'm in my layer. Is it blue? Yes it is. And there I have it. It's probably a bit deeper orange than I want than I really want it to be. But that'll do. Next, I'm going to check which one I'm going to draw. I'm going to draw this one here. Okay? And then I'm going to copy and paste the others. I'm going to do this on last because it has no it doesn't have any colour in here. So I'm gonna make a new layer, move it out of the way, take the green away. So I'm gonna check my colours. This green here, or this turquoisey green, is the same as this turquoisey green here. It's like a deep turquoise. So I know that I only need to use one, two, three, four colours. So I'm gonna get a first of all I'm gonna go and get my line tool. I'm not going to use a pencil tool, I'm going to use a line tool and make the glass. My line tool is here. I'm going to go and get the size that I want. I'm just going to do a quick test and change that colour. That's probably a bit too thick. That'll do me. Now I probably don't want exactly black. I probably want something a little bit off black. So a dark charcoal grey. Now then, I don't need this line, so I can go and undo that line. Let's go and get an eraser, will do me. And then I'm gonna go and draw my glass. I'm going to do this quickly.
and you can see why using a line tool is much better than drawing freehand with a pencil. That'll do me to start with. So that's the top of my glass. Then I'm going to do the body and the stem. Okay, so I've got my wine glass done. I'm just going to go and colour it in, colour in the, the, the wine itself, and then choose a deep turquoise to colour in the the glass itself. Once I've done that, I can go and use the white select, which is over here, the white select tool. Okay. And I can pick up my selection and make sure it fits. Once I know that it fits, I go to the blue, click on the blue, and it allows me now to copy my glass. Go and get a new layer. Go and name this Wine Glass 2. Make sure it's blue, that's the layer I want to be in. Make sure I copy this. And you can see that a wine glass has, has appeared in here. If I just move this out of the way, I've got two wine glasses now. I can do the same, add a new layer, wine glass 3, put the, the third glass in. And then I can go and erase this green and this green here, and I've got four wine glasses. That is your task from now to go and make those other wine glasses and arrange them like this on top of each other on different layers. Thank you.